If you're new, press the bell icon to get the latest notifications. All right, uh, sorry for the introduction. Now, uh, what if I told you that there's a way that you can trade with very low risk and uh, we trade patterns. What if I, I'm searching for a pattern and I tell you to trade a pattern like this was Kishu that we trade actually. And then I give you some very quick updates in a very simple place, in one place at all. And uh, these quick updates can uh, help you to trade with me, okay? Whenever I trade, you trade with me. And I use my experience and my best knowledge, which you have been looking at. And you, you get to do the same with proper money management. And you get more chances of winning, which actually give you more guidance. And you don't have to be worried about your daily routine. It doesn't actually get disturbed. Now, all you have to do is just come down to uh, the description of the video. Scroll down, go to the signals agreement. You see this video and you agree to the uh, agreement. It's a very simple, very straightforward agreement, nothing big. And then you click on Discord and you join the Discord. Now, once you have joined the Discord, all you have to do is go to the announcement tab and click on my name, Adam Coins. And all you do is you can click on message and you message me if you want to join and you're interested. So the entries do close by the end of the month. Not too much time there. Asalaamu As Alaikum everyone and welcome back to Bitcoin Update today. All right, so we are not very, very good with Bitcoin at the moment. So this is going to be a problem for Bitcoin. I don't know if Bitcoin is interested anymore to make it $27,000. But let me tell you one thing, ever since uh, this thing popped down, I am not trading, okay? Because some people do follow me and they try to mimic what I do. So I think it's a good, better idea. Be uh, even though I say it's not a financial advice video and the be best place for you to try to copy me is, of course, where I told you in the beginning of the video, where I am making trades, that's where it's best for you to come and trade instead of looking at a video and then expecting the things to happen because when I close a trade you might not know if I'm closing the trade because if this video goes out after five minutes if I see any change if I see maybe it's interested to go up I might even actually start trading again then what are you going to do so if you want to know when I do that again that's where uh, I'm into the trades at, at the moment so Right now, uh, the plan was to $27,000, but we're still finding this as big resistance. And unfortunately, we're finding some really, really big divergences going on. On the four hour time frame, it's happening. On the daily time frame, it's happening. So too much of a bearish divergence is happening at the moment. And that's going to cause trouble. That's really going to cause trouble. Not only that, but if you look at render, this is uh, render on the four hour time frame and you're looking for this one huge top second top and you are making a double top right now you have a neckline and you come down to the neckline break the neckline and you go to 0.8218 that actually is going to make it a 60 percent drop down if this happens okay number one number two i've talked about mana at the moment and i'm going to show you mana this has a Wyckoff distribution on a four hour time frame. So this is how I do look at it. And this is the whole Wyckoff distribution happening for mana. And you can see this is where the, the whole image resides. Bitcoin had Wyckoff distribution as well. I'm gonna show you in a second right now. Actually, let's, let me show you Bitcoin uh, Wyckoff distribution. Bitcoin had the very, very same thing on the daily. So let me show you that very, very quickly. We're going to dive in into the daily right there and go back here in back in uh, maybe 2021 or something. So this is where the Wyckoff distribution happened. So whatever this was of uh, actually not this uh, somewhere here. Yeah. So whatever this mini thing was here, whatever you see here, this one, this, all of this is what mana is doing on a four hour time frame. And you can see how bad it, uh, down it went. And that's where I want you to be pretty careful about uh, mana at the moment that's where mana is making all that distribution on a four hour time frame it's actually this one right over there okay so yeah to me personally that is the negative aspect you see that's that's a negative aspect of course but you also have some few other aspects where things are bullish and they still need to go up they want to actually push up so it's a mixed thing because some of the few coins they pushed up some of them didn't push up and they want to push up the ones that went up matic render mana they've already been overbought and they have bearish divergences and they want to go down bitcoin also have a bearish divergence and if, we, if i have to keep things simple why don't we just learn from bitcoin higher highs lower highs simple it's a bearish divergence 
and somehow it can pull it down this can be pulled down this is something that i this is the reason why i'm not in a trade can it still go up to twenty seven thousand dollars perhaps it can i think it should but then again uh let's say it does go to twenty seven thousand dollars i would rather wait for the daily to be oversold so that i can try to enter and trade way safe than before right so that's pretty much it for this update on bitcoin right now i'm going to see you the next one i love this